What's up guys, welcome back to another video of me, SuperFudgeDoor7. Today my friends, I will be showing you guys how to obtain the Maelstrom slash Death Machine special weapon in the new Sky Ritual map, Tides of Terror. Without any further ado, let's get into this. It starts by doing a little bit of the normal easter egg, but slowly becomes its own step. So as soon as you spawn into the map, you need to go over to this cannon on Sky Beach where you'll be able to interact with it. Upon doing this, you will get markers that come up on the screen and you must now go and locate a fuse and also a cannonball. The cannonball can be found inside of the East Shipwreck Lower Deck. As for the fuse, you can find this at the bottom of the West Shipwreck inside of the cargo hold. Once you've obtained both of these parts, head back to Skur Beach. Once again, interact with the cannon. Now a circle is going to spawn, so you need to make sure that you're standing in the circle whilst killing zombies. Once you've got the max amount of zombies, you're now going to be able to interact with the cannon again. This time, it's going to shoot at the cave and it's going to open it up. Now enter the cave. Upon doing so, you will find that there are these hives similar to the ones in sewers. In order to progress through the cave, you must shoot these hives. Upon doing so, you will notice that the vines will disappear, allowing you to access the rest of the area. Eventually, you will come up to a door where you'll be able to interact with it. Once you interact with this door, it will now give you three different quests. But since you want to get your hands on the death machine, you're going to choose the bronze sword quest. So path through the cave, go through this door, and you will locate a cell where you can interact with it. Once you interact with this door, you will now be onto the bronze sword quest, but you don't actually have have to do any of the steps. This was just to get the initial trigger so that you can actually go into the supercharge room and shoot the map and break the lock. Ironically, you don't have to complete it as of right now. Perhaps they'll change that in the future, but as of right now, you don't have to complete this quest. So head on through the Western Shipwreck, go up the stairs. From here, you can now go to the Supercharger room, and in this room, you will see a map on the wall. As it stands, this map is being held up by lock and key. All you have to do is shoot the locks. Once you've shot this, it will reveal a map, and on this map, you will see X marks a spot. This changes every game, and until you reveal this map, you won't be able to to look for treasure. But once you've revealed the map and shot it down, head back to Skur Beach. You will now be able to find dig sites around the area. You can just go to each of them and you won't fail it, but it will spawn loads of crabs. I like to do this because I think it would be good for the soul steps in the Easter egg. However, it is down to you. So look at the map and find where your treasure is buried and go to that spot on Skur Beach. Once you dig it up, you will find that there is a key. Once you've obtained this key, you can take it to the Eastern ship's lower deck where you can use it to unlock the death machine or the maelstrom wonder weapon special weapon that was a tongue twister anyways guys i know there's been some confusion on how to do this and that's why i wanted to make sure i got a guide out i must say i really liked that this wasn't essential to the main quest and it was sort of like its own little side quest also this thing is really good when it's tier three and it is so so good when you use it at tier four i literally could go to such a high round and it's really fun to use as well and once you do start firing it is really powerful and it melts the main boss there's not a lot to not like about it what can i say it's a freaking death machine anyways guys that has been how to get the death machine inside of your game i hope you found this guide useful and i shall see you guys in my next video